Hey guys, this is Matt from the 476 Honeybees. Today we're going to talk about making the bees some food. Uh, we have two new nukes here and we're going to help them out a little bit. You know, the pollen, the nectar, they're going to forage that themselves. But I have two feeders on each hive and I'm going to show you guys how to make sugar water. You know, you don't always want to make sugar water and feed the bees. When you have your supers on top, which is uh, where they store the honey at, you don't want to feed your bees. But if you catch a new swarm, you have a wheat colony or a packaged bees or a new nuke, you want to boost them a little bit because they're really trying to feed that new brood. So let's go into the kitchen and show you how to make this sugar water. This is the entrance fitter that I use and this is good for a beginning colony, but I like the half top entrances that uh, Kyle Huff will show you later in the week. Um, there's a lot of different feeders that you use. This is pretty easy. If you can go to it every day. Uh, like Huff, he, he leaves for a week. So the, the half top entrance is better because it holds around five gallons. Instead, this is just a pint. So I can control how much they eat better right now, but it's a little, it's a little bit more of a hassle. I think, uh, later on, I'm gonna get the half top feeders and put these on my, uh, five frame nukes. So we're gonna make a gallon of sugar water. And the first thing we're gonna do is do uh, one part sugar, one part water. So that's a half gallon of water. You can get this really warm or let it go to a bowl. I'm gonna go let it go to a bowl so the sugar dissolves faster. So once it starts boiling, we'll bring it back to the video. All right, to make a gallon of sugar water, we have your half gallon bowling right now, and you use eight pounds of sugar to every half gallon of water. Now, as the season gets closer to the winter, you're gonna do two parts sugar, one, uh, one part water. So you do 66% sugar. And we'll get that to later in closer to December. I'm gonna bring it back to the bowl and slowly stir. And once I get it uh, done, I will show you what I stored. As you guys can see, the sugar has dissolved. This is only took about five minutes, so it doesn't take real long to make. Um, I'm gonna let this cool, and then we will pour it into our feeders and my gallon jug. All right, folks, here it is. The sugar water, I keep it in this gallon jug. I make it about two to three times a week, not too bad. Here's my feeder, and I'm about to go place it on the entrance of my feeder house. Make sure to follow us and like us on our Facebook and Instagram, 476 Honeybees.